Five is one of those zombies maps that produces a kind of frantic feeling that honestly isn't felt in any of the newer zombies maps produced in maybe the last two years or so for me. When playing this map to get the gameplay for this video, my heart was freaking pounding. Nothing produces the same kind of claustrophobic, exhilarating, and genuinely scary experience like 5 does for me. I think it's for me, at least personally, the most underrated zombies map of all time. Probably one of the most difficult as well. But in today's video, as you saw in the title, we're talking about that as of yesterday evening, all four members of the five crew are now deceased, with Fidel Castro going down for the count at 90 yesterday. There was a neat little picture on Reddit by a user named Jail the Way entitled, You Can't Stop Zombies, But You Can't Stop Time. And in the picture, we got the five crew with little badges showing how long they lived. At fourth place, we have JFK, who went down for the count not long after five was set on November 22nd, 1963. That was followed by Richard Nixon in third place, who died April 22nd, 1994. In second place, we have Robert McNamara, the former Secretary of Defense, who died on July 6th, 2009. And of course, finishing off the tally, we have Fidel Castro, who died yesterday, November 25th, 2016. Now, in regards to the Five Crew and the Zombies story, we actually got a bit of an update on that inside of Revelations. There is a radio in the Dreisendrock area of the map from Robert McNamara, and this is what it says. This is Secretary of Defense Robert McNamara. I am transmitting on a secure channel in the most dire of circumstances. The Pentagon is under attack from an unknown enemy. As of this moment, I am safely ensconced inside a janitor's closet. Unfortunately, I fear the president and the VIPs may not have found similar safe haven. <laughs> from what I have observed, our attackers may be blighted by some kind of sickness. Either that or they're just dirty hippies under the influence of hallucinogenic substances. I can only hope that this message will bring rescue. Until then, please, pray for me. So basically what McNamara was saying is that he feared that the President Kennedy, as well as the two VIPs, Castro and Nixon, were dead and didn't find safe haven like he did. McNamara said he was hiding inside a janitor's closet, meaning he's not dead yet, and he was calling out for rescue, and he was hoping that rescue would finally happen. We don't know if McNamara actually made it out of the Pentagon according to the zombie's storyline, but it's awesome that we got a little bit of an update from the Five crew inside of Revelations. Before this, Five seemed like this map that was outside of canon, that was different from the regular zombie storyline with our four characters, and instead has now been encompassed within the main storyline thanks to Revelations. All the pieces may not still fit, but I just wanted to make this quick video to commemorate 5 and the 5 crew. But I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely remember to leave those rips down in the comments, guys, and I'll see you with another video tomorrow. Rest in peace.